We've just been watching an otter. And we just seen a mink. point of this would be <laughs> hopefully you can see the otter just down here hello guys so uh, welcome to this week's vlog we have just spotted an otter uh, three times Actually four times I have to tell you it's a magical experience absolutely magical experience I'll put a bit of a uh, bit of the vlog when we actually saw it a second ago so anyway hope you enjoyed uh, the vlog this time cheers so good morning we're just uh, just having a quick check and see if we can find our lone signet we had a lone gosling a few months back well a couple of months back and we've been waiting and waiting for our signets our swan's nest and eggs to hatch um, in the last two or three days the uh, the nest was empty and then we saw a photograph on social media uh, where a guy had taken a photograph of a swan with two signets up here. So we were up to have a look, see if we could find, excuse me a second, <laughs> fly by in my hand. We, uh, we, we wandered and we found the two swans, the pair of swans, had moved from the small lake where the nest was onto this main lake and there was one signet. One signet with them so already it would appear <laughs> that one of the signets has gone um, the two swans were acting fairly strange they were sort of swimming around near the edge of the bank excuse me and uh, almost looking into the reeds looking up onto the bank And I wonder whether they were looking for the second one. So hopefully it's still around and they were just trying to coax it into the water. The area where the nest is, is um, definitely frequented by mink. This, uh, there's been a sighting of, or quite a few sightings of mink in this area. Um, nasty little sight. You can uh, really take out a lot of, uh, of the wildlife. We've some, we've so, we saw one, we saw a, a very quick sighting of one in that area, very close to where that nest is currently. So um, I'm gonna have a wander and see if I can hopefully see two signets, but not holding up that much hope. Cheers. Hello, Saturday morning. It's really still. Really, really still. Literally, it's not a breath of wind. Oh. Whole gaggle of Canada geese uh, taking off, actually. There they go through the trees. Yeah, the geese there. yeah they are and there's lots of um, water boatmen on the on the lake I'm assuming that's what they are
isn't it gorgeous? Let's go and uh, let's go and see if we can find our lone signet. Oh yeah. So just spotted our swan. And she has two signets. So yesterday the pair we saw with only one signet on the lake, the other one, I said at the time that the, they were looking into the reeds and they were looking at the bank, looking rather worried and nervous. Well, that was because the second one must have been in the, uh, in the, uh, on, the on the bank. So I'm just gonna wander around and get a couple of photographs. They're very young, obviously still cute, but uh, hopefully both these two will make it through. Uh, bear with me while I get some bushwhacking done. Gosh, it's getting overgrown in here. Oh my goodness. Yikes. <laughs> Thing is, after rain, it's also wet, and you get soaked as well. But hey, I'll keep quiet because uh, I don't want to disturb them too much. There she is. to mention uh, the, the huge benefits of getting outside and getting outdoors and trying to get to places that are, are wild even even areas in towns and cities you know your local park or um, green spaces green areas it just it just helps yourself it helps mindfulness it helps you know, relax from stresses and strains. And the period we've been through, it's been so tough, so dreadful. Um, you know, and hopefully, it don't have to, who knows if it's on the way out, because it seems like it's coming back again, but just being out, getting away from the office, getting away from the, from the shop floor, just gets you into this sort of fantastic place. You hear the bird song, you can hear the silence. You can watch the birds, watch nature. So if you can do it, just do it. It's, it's brilliant, brilliant. <laughs> it really is, it makes such a difference. It's made a big difference to me, big, big difference personally. And I was in lockdown, it was really tough, not going anywhere, couldn't see anybody. Um, now that's released a bit, it's good, it's good news, but it's still getting out here, taking up photography and um, seeing stuff I've never seen before. You know, I was always into nature and bird life and nature, you know, but but this is just spectacular. I'm going to shut up now and get some pictures of these swans. searching for kingfishers. I think we saw one down here just a second ago, um, but didn't manage to get a photograph. We're moving a bit too fast, but really want to get one in the next uh, couple of weeks. So that's my next uh, aim, objective. It's nice here though. Bird song.
honestly don't think I've seen so much wildlife on this lake. It's amazing. It's incredible. It's really beautiful this morning. Absolutely beautiful. The sun is just burning its way through the cloud. It's starting to get very warm. So it's going to be a nice one today. Over and out. Hey guys. I'm just uh, enjoying the stillness and silence of this place. Feels like I'm speaking too loud, really. You just feel like you're miles from anywhere. We sort of aren't, really. But no one around. Just utterly still. special moment just been uh, we just saw a fleeting glimpse of an otter um, popping up going back down hunting and then getting out on a, a tree branch but then saw us and straight back in um, we followed it followed it round margins of the lake but we haven't spotted it since but a magic moment magic absolutely magic and we just seen a mink running across this path Obviously running from the lake into this hedge on the left. We're not going to see it now. But, um, <laughs> so they're in this area too. Well, what a few days it's been. Thanks for watching this video, guys. Don't forget, give me a like, comment, subscribe if you like, or whatever you choose to do. You just stay safe. Have a good week, and I'll see you next time. Cheers.